President Donald Trump's army secretary nominee is accusing the liberal left of mischaracterizing and blatantly falsifying his comments on terrorism, the Islamic State and the LGBT community. The liberal left has cut and spliced my words about terrorism and ISIS blatantly falsifying what if said, drive. Mark Green, a Tennessee state senator, wrote in a Facebook post early Tuesday. The post included a link to a Christian fighter pilot report. The site brands itself as a venue for Christians in the military, and the article accuses LGBT advocates of targeting Green over his religion. It would seem that this gentleman has figured out why certain people are cutting and splicing my words to paint me as a hater, Green wrote, referring to the author of the report, which does not include a byline. It will not stand. Green had been criticized. Comments on a radio program in which he referred to Syrian refugees, who he called ISIS people and transgender bathroom access fights as evil. Evil is crushed, so I'm going to protect women in their bathrooms, and I'm going to protect our state against potential infiltration of Syrian ISIS people through a refugee program, Green said on the program. The New York Times reported LGBT groups, criticism of Trump's selection of Green as Army Secretary earlier this month. The American Military Partner Association, the largest group of LGBT military families, said Green has made a shameful political career out of targeting LGBT people. Discrimination. The group's president, Ashley Broadway Mark, added that Green has a vicious anti-LGBT record and cannot be trusted to ensure all those who serve have the support they need and deserve. The Times noted that Green has a history of controversial statements regarding LGBT rights, including telling the Chattanooga Tea Party at an event last year, if you poll the psychiatrists, they're going to tell you that transgender is a disease. Green argues in his Facebook post, however, that he has never and will never force my religion on anyone, and said he believes every American has a right to defend their country regardless of race, ethnicity, gender, sexual orientation, gender identity, and religion. It's the radical left that won't allow the latter, he said. I have never considered myself a judge of anyone, but I have been a protector of everyone in this nation. Green is Trump's second nominee to lead the army. The first, Vincent Viola, withdrew his nomination in February after struggling to disentangle himself from his business ties. If confirmed, Green's tenure would follow Eric Fanning the first openly gay civilian leader of the army. Tara Palmieri contributed to this report.